Welcome to Coffee with Christian. My name is Christian Mael and I give the best tips on how to read the Bible and how to grow spiritually. Today we're talking about the best Bible reading plan for beginners. So if you are a Christian that you are interested in reading the Bible and uh, get to know God intimately and go deeper in your relationship with God, I believe that you need a Bible reading plan. Reading the Bible is one of the most important things that you and I as a Christian, as a believer, we need to practice, we need to do, and having a Bible reading plan is extremely important. And I'm gonna tell you why. It's because it's a guide. Having a Bible reading plan, it's like when you and I uh, go to the gym without a plan, we don't, we just walk around and we don't know what to do. When we have a Bible reading plan, it's like having a workout exercise routine that we're following so it makes it more enjoyable and much better so i'm gonna share with you the best bible reading plan and i have it in my hand and it's gonna be in the description of this video now i'm gonna give you a few reasons why i believe that this is the best bible reading plan that you can uh, follow and that will help you grow spiritually i guarantee you that if you start reading the bible today in a year, you're going to know more scripture and know more about God than you have being a Christian without reading and following a Bible reading plan. But before I give you the reasons why I believe that this is the best Bible reading plan, let me remind you that you are on a spiritual journey. We are in a journey. We're not going to get to the finish line tomorrow or next year. So it's very important that you understand that being a Christian and reading the Bible is a journey. In a year, you're going to know more scripture than you know today if you start today. But sometimes one of the biggest uh, enemies that I face is like, well, I don't know as much as I should know, or I don't know all of the things I should know as a Christian, so I don't do it. That is one of the biggest enemies that you're going to face in your spiritual walk. But let me encourage you that you're in a journey. The more that you practice this discipline, the easier they're going to become. So I'm going to share with you why I believe that this is the best Bible reading plan for you. Reason number one is that it's one chapter per day. It is simple. Now, I know most people, when they uh, want to start reading the Bible, they want to jump in and read the entire thing in a year. Well, the Bible, it's big. It's It covers over 4,000 years. It has 66 books in the Bible. It can be very intimidating for people so having a bible reading plan it helps you uh start that journey and that process of reading the bible and hear what god wants you to do as a believer so having a, a bible reading plan that is one chapter a day it's something that everybody can do it takes less than five minutes i do this bible reading plan take me less than five minutes and english is my second language so i guarantee you can do this in less than five minutes and not just reading just to read uh i hear all the times if you don't follow me on instagram i want to encourage you to follow me at christian mael i give the best bible reading uh tips in their tune how to grow spiritually i share sermon clips as well uh, but one of the most comments i get often is people telling me well you should be in a one-year Bible reading plan. Oh, you shouldn't tell people just to read one chapter a day. People need to read the entire Bible. True. As a Christian, as a believer, we should be reading the entire book of the Bible. But if you don't have the discipline, if you don't have uh, the plan to read the Bible, it's very difficult for people to do. Just like I said, you know, working out, me going to the gym without a plan, I just go to walk around, I don't know what to do, and I live frustrated. I don't want you to read the Bible and be like, well, I don't understand what's happening, so I'm just not gonna do it. No, that's the worst thing that you can do. I believe that at least one chapter a day, you reading, meditating, asking questions, journaling, uh, texting somebody about what you learned can really transform your life your spiritual life and your spiritual walk with God. So I want to encourage you to get this Bible reading plan because it's simple. It takes less than five minutes, one chapter a day. We all can do that. Number two is that this Bible reading plan in one year, you will read the entire New Testament. You got 27 books in the New Testament 
plus Proverbs and Psalms from the Old Testament. And it's really cool because you're just not reading the book of Matthew. You're going to have the book of Matthew. And in between some of those days, you're going to be reading a couple chapters from the book of Proverbs, a couple chapters from the book of Psalms, which is it's very enjoyable. And you get to read some of the Old Testament as you're reading the New Testament. So you have you will be reading 29 books of the Bible in one year. I know, but there is 66 books in the Bible. Well, next year you can do a Bible reading plan on the Old Testament. And in two years, you can read the entire book of the Bible. I feel like that's one of the biggest mistakes that people make. They try to read the entire Bible in a year. And what they do is just try to read it fast to consume it all and to say that they did it but they don't take the time to really study the book. And that's why I believe this Bible reading plan with only one chapter a day, it allows you to read it and also study it. I like using a study Bible. I'm going to leave a link in the description of this video of the Bible that I use. It has study notes and it also have a margin where you can write and take your own notes. So one of the things that I like doing is when I finish my Bible, I like reading what the the Bible study notes that are in the Bible, and it allows me to understand it better. The third reason why this Bible reading plan, it is so beneficial for you. It's because it's simple. Now I'm a person that I like simple things. I like keeping things very simple. When I go to the gym, when I go to the grocery store, because if I overcomplicate my life, I get excited for something for a few weeks, but then I just give up and quit because it's too hard. That's why this Bible reading plan is so beneficial because it's extremely, extremely, extremely simple. And how you build a habit is by keeping things simple and doing it every single day. So I want to encourage you get this Bible reading plan and schedule your time. Make sure that you have it on your calendar. When are you going to be reading? For me, I do it before I go to work. I normally go to a coffee shop or I do it here in the studio. And I like just having my coffee and my Bible reading time. I like doing it before I go to work. That might be how, what works for you. Maybe for you is doing it right before you go to bed or in the middle of the day. But the most important thing is that you put it in your calendar because there's two kinds of people, the people that schedule the time with God and the people that are trying to find time to spend time with God. And normally the people that are trying to find time, never find time because we live in a very, very busy world and if you don't schedule your time with god it will be very difficult to stay consistent even though it's simple if you don't put it in your calendar it's not going to happen so i want to encourage you put it in your calendar another advice and i think that it will help you uh, stay consistent it's doing it with a friend so i want to encourage you when you download this bible reading plan also send it to one of your friends and ask them Hey, would you commit to read the Bible every single day with me and send them this video? It takes less than five minutes a day. And I guarantee you when you do that and every single day you text that friend, it will help you grow spiritually in an incredible way. I want to tell you that that has been one of my most significant things that I've done in the past two years. I text my accountability partner every single morning what I got from the word of God and he does the same and what this is doing is helping me stay consistent because somebody's waiting on my text but number two it's also I am thinking about what I read because I have to text Blake every single day and every single day I get to read also what Blake got from the Bible reading plan I want to encourage you get the Bible reading plan Put it in your calendar and text a friend every single day. On the description of this video, you're going to see this Bible reading plan. Super simple to do. I want you to comment if you uh, download it because I want to make sure that I'm also encouraging you. I believe that reading the word of God every single day will help you grow and learn more from God. I know a chapter a day is super simple. And for some people, it's like you should be reading more. But I believe that it's going to help you grow spiritually. Let me know in the comments if you download it, because I want to encourage you and I want to know who has joined this Bible reading plan. I'll see you next time.